Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a DIY for you and it's a DIY wine bottle uh, like light. So if you want to see how I made this, then stay tuned. So things that you will need for this project is you're going to need an old wine bottle. You're going to need some uh, scrap ribbon. You're going to need some LED lights or Christmas lights. Um, they could have the power cord that plugs in or it could be a battery pack one. This is just what I have, so I'm going to use this. And these were the string lights. These are originally $29.99. These are from Michaels. I got these for free dumpster diving. So I'm going to use those and you're going to need an assortment of fake or artificial flowers. Well, that is what artificial flowers are, are fake. <laughs> and you're going to need a hot glue gun and glue sticks. So you're going to want to make sure that your bottle is clean for this project. Um, mine still has a little bit of water residue in it um, just for me needing to rewash it out, but that's okay. I'm not going to let it sit and dry overnight. It'll dry eventually um, with the lights and stuff in there. So now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make the pack, the pouch that's going to hold your battery pack. So I'm going to show you that next. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to make a little pouch to hold the little battery pack for your lights. So what you're going to want to do is I just took some scrap um, ribbon that I've had and we're going to go ahead and make the thing. So I have one slightly larger and one slightly smaller. So I'm going to take the larger one and that one's going to be the width to go up this way and then this one is going to wrap around it. So it's going to be somewhat like that. So what we're going to do is we are going to take the hot glue gun we're going to put some glue right here and we're going to attach this piece like right here so once my hot glue has heated up We're going to glue it there. Then what we're going to do is we're going to put the pack in. Bring this up like this. And we're going to put glue here and glue this to it. So So now we have a little pouch for our battery pack. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to clean it up. Alright, so now we're going to take our bottle, we're going to place it down, and we are going 
to glue the little pouch to the bottle itself. So I'm going to put glue here. And we're now going to glue this down to the label. So now we have the little pouch for the battery pack. It will then sit right in here. sit on the bottle just like that and there is your little pouch to hold your battery pack I'm gonna go through I'm gonna add some more glue just to make sure that it stays all right so now that we have our battery pack holster on and glued in we're now going to feed the lights into the bottle itself going to want to try to find the end of your lights and you're just pretty much just going to feed the lights into the bottle. So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to feed the lights through and I will be back. So once you have fed all of your lights through, it'll look something like this. And now what we're going to do is because we're going to secure the light to the top right here. We're going to take some hot glue, put a little right there, and we're just going to press the light down into that hot glue. And that will help hold your light, lights in place. So again, this is what the bottle will look like so far. So now we're going to go ahead and we're going to go ahead and we're going to decorate the top right here. All right, so now I've got my flowers. So I've got these ones and I've got these ones. And we'll go ahead and I'm going to play with them and see what I like better. All right, so now I'm going to embellish the bottle and I'm going to take, I've got two acorns, these little things, and I'm going to glue them like right there. So I'm going to take my other acorn and I'm going to cut the stem off just with some scissors. I'm going to glue this one right here. 
So now I'm just going to go ahead and add in some flowers to decorate it. And I will be back once it's fully decorated. All right, so I went ahead and I finished decorating the bottle and that is what it looks like. So now I'm going to turn off the lights and I'm going to show you what it looks like. And there you go. That is the DIY wine bottle light. I hope you enjoy.